It turns out mom was right when she made you practice piano every day. New research at Northwestern shows that children who study music for several years also improve their language skills. Very nice, Naomi's turn. The research that we've done is an argument for, um, for, for music education and for early music education. We reasoned that if um, people had musical training and musical training uh, that involved their listening to pitch and pitch patterns, that that training might transfer not only to music, but transfer to speech or transfer to other sounds, that uh, music training might have a pervasive effect on the nervous system. Okay, so Krista, we're going to be putting three electrodes on your head today. We're going to put one on your forehead, one on the top of your head, and one behind your right earlobe. Go we had native English speakers listen to Mandarin sounds. At the same time, the person is watching a video and they're listening to the soundtrack of the video. So these Mandarin sounds are just played in the background. Mandarin is a tonal language, and there are particular changes in pitch that occur within a syllable. And so we can plot what that pitch contour is. So just physically, the pitch contour can go up and then down and then up again. For a Mandarin speaker, this me, this steady me, means to sip. This rising me means confusion. Me and this dipping me means rice. And what we do is we measure the response of the brain to these Mandarin sounds because we synchronize, we can synchronize the delivery of these sounds with the recording of the physiologic events. As I'm talking to you now, the nerves in your brain that respond to sound are giving off electricity and we can measure those electrical events. And you can see that the neural response of this non-musician is not following the pitch contour of the stimulus at all compared to this musician where you can see this very beautiful representation from cycle to cycle of the neurons that are responding absolutely in concert with the pitch of the stimulus. In our study, the subjects were not professional musicians. These were just ordinary people who had studied music. The longer that they had studied music, the bigger the effects. Also, the earlier that they began their musical training, the more uh, enhanced their sensory processing was. But it really should be emphasized, it's not about um, your child becoming a professional violinist. It is just about their getting the Very education. Nice. I mean, I, I really see it as, as part, a, a fundamental part of education. And unfortunately, it's uh, music, as with foreign language, is one of the things that, uh, that get, get cut, even in our schools here in Evanston.